Hi guys, as promised today I'm showing you how I made the gumball machine hideaway from my sweet themed hamster cage. To make this you'll need a large paper cup, and I chose to use a popcorn cup, a half inflated balloon, some non-toxic white glue, and plain white paper. You'll also need some pet safe paints such as vegetable food colouring or soy paint. To begin, tear your paper into strips and place them into a bowl of water for about 30 seconds. But if you want to create a more solid structure, soak the paper in a mix of flour and water instead. Place your balloon into something that helps it stand upright and start covering it with the wet paper one piece at a time. Be sure to leave the balloon knot exposed so you can remove the balloon later. Once you've completely covered the balloon in several layers of paper, you need to leave it to dry and this can take anywhere from a few hours to a few days depending on your climate and how thick the paper is. Storing it somewhere warm and dry will help speed the process up. When the paper has dried fully, you can remove the balloon by cutting a small hole in the top of it to release the air. Gently pull the balloon out, making sure none of it is left inside the paper ball. Next, grab your paper cup, turn it upside down, and cut a large hole in the front for a doorway. Pop the paper ball on top with a little hole facing downwards, and use the white glue to stick it in place. After the glue has dried, you can use your pet safe paint to start painting on the gumballs. And there are no rules here. Use whatever colours you want, make them whatever size you want. It is entirely up to you. The last thing that I decided to do, which is completely optional, is to glue a small wooden ball just above the doorway so it looks like the coin pusher. You don't have to do this step, I just felt like it was the perfect finishing touch. So there you are, that is how I made the gumball machine hideaway. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a thumbs up. You can also share this video with your friends and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Thank you so much for watching guys and I'll see you next time. Bye bye!